Hey guys, welcome to Fur Tutorials. Guys, today I create shiny and golden particle logo animation in After Effect. So firstly, guys, I create new composition. And guys, preset I take full HD frame this one. And duration I take only 10 second. And press OK. And now, guys, I go on project, right click, import and import file. Guys, see, this is my logo and this is my shiny texture and star texture and import guys i give you all texture and my project file download from my website link in description so select this aladdin logo drag and drop in main com and now pre com this logo right click and pre composition and guys type only logo and move all attribute check and press ok and now guys hide this logo hide and one more time right click new and this time I take text and guys type anything like produce yeah and now guys go on align and go on here here and guys this is my center pivot go on mid the shortcut command is control alt press home button and again i take text tool go on center yeah that's it guys one more time align yeah this is my text is aligned and now same pre-com right click and pre-com and guys type only text and move all your attribute check and press ok yes and guys select this text layer and i go to 5 second 5 second and now i create new solid layer and this time name noise and press ok guys select this noise and i go to effect and presets effect and presets and type fracture noise select this fracture noise apply on here noise layer and guys fracture type use dynamic twist and increase contrast like 150 yes and i go to transform here and scale size same 150 yeah that's good and now guys increase complexity I take like 20 and I go to sub setting and guys this is my sub scaling increase like 85 yes this good and lastly guys go on evolution and press alt key and click this evolution and type time time star 50 and enter and play see guys this is my waving effect right okay so now guys select this noise and duplicate i go to edit copy and paste and guys select the second noise and only invert check that's it so select this both noise layer and right click precom and type noise yes and press ok so guys hide this noise hide and go on layer first layer logo and guys type cc image wipe cc image wipe select apply on logo yeah and i go to firstly gradient and layer and take noise and guys go on zero frame and complexion check and complexion take 100% and guys I go to two second and complex take zero I go to four second and guys select this logo layer press U and create key only check and I go to six second and complexion take 100% go on back and play 
yeah that's good yeah nice and guys same effect apply on this text so effect and presets cc image wipe apply on text layer i go to five second and actually you can hide this layer select this here same layer and take noise and complexion check on five second and guys complexion i take 100 percent i go to seven second and complexion take zero and i go to nine second nine and complexion take zero create keyframe yes and i go to 10 frame and complexion take 100 percent yeah that's it guys see guys this is my animation yeah that's really good okay so stop guys now i create waving effect so one more time right click and new and guys this time i take adjustment layer select this adjustment layer go on here yes and i go to four second four second yeah go on take this layer and guys i go on effect and presets type turbulence displays apply on adjustment layer and create animation guys go on zero frame and amount check amount take zero and i go to two second and amount i take 50 and i go to four second and amount take zero yeah that's it go on back and play yeah that's good okay so guys select this adjustment layer and press u and select all keyframes and press f9 for easy ease okay so stop guys select this adjustment layer and duplicate press ctrl d select go on top actually go on up only and size change yes go on here yeah see guys guys you can change little bit amount so select this adjustment layer this one too and press u go on here and amount i take like 30 go on back and play yes great okay and now guys i create zooming effect so right click and new i take like null object this one and select go on here this position and guys go on zero frame and guys go on layer and connect with this null one here this is my null object and press scale tool s go on zero frame and scale size check and scale size take like 80 go on 10 second and scale size like 120 yes go on back and play nice guys same so right click new and take solid actually null object select go on up and guys go on text and connect with this null object too and select guys go on five second and here so press s and check guys scale size take 80 and 10 second take 120 enter so play
yeah that's really good okay so stop guys all is good and now i create new composition go on composition and new and guys type like color and press ok guys i go on effect project and select this glass texture apply on color and i go to effect and presets and type cc repeat tile select and apply yeah guys increase size randomly yes and guys now i create animation so go on effect and presets and type offset select this one offset apply on glass texture layer go on zero frame guys shift center check and click on here and check yes and i go to 10 second and shift center go on here yes see guys this is my animation but guys this is not correct so tiling here and take unfold yeah that's better and guys this is also not correct this showing lines and little bit change yes see guys now this is fixed yes great okay so guys animation is finished i take color correction so go on effect and presets type tin select this tint apply on glass texture and amount change like 40 and guys go on again effect and preset type curve select this curve and apply yes little bit decrease lighting darker yes and last time type fast blur select this fast blur legacy apply on glass texture and amount i take like 10 yes see guys all is good and guys lastly i create new solid layer and guys lastly i create one more time new composition go on comp and new comp type final logo and press ok guys create new background solid and type bg and i go to effect and presets type ramp select this gradient ramp apply on background layer and guys ramp shape change little bit darker red and end color i take z black yes see guys this is my background and now i go on project guys select this color this is my color apply on this final layer and select this comp one this is my final actually first animation so select and select this color and use alpha mat see guys right and change some settings guys go on effect and presets and type cc this one globalize and apply on color yes guys go on first one and change layer like com1 and property i take alpha and go on light actually guys change some softness softness like 10 yeah that's better and cut away like five and light change guys this is my light type 
I take point light and all is good. Yeah, finish. And now guys, I create color correction. So I take curve, select this curve and apply on solid layer. Guys, RGB color mode, increase like this and change channel. I take red, increase like this and guys change this green and increase yeah and last one I take blue and blue go on here see guys this is my golden shining logo go on back and play see guys this is my final animation Yeah, this is so nice. Okay, and guys, pre-com, select both layer and right click logo and type final logo animation. Yes, and guys, go on project, project, select this star and apply on final layer. Yes, see guys, this is my stars. Right guys, this my final logo animation is finished. So if you like my video, please share and subscribe my YouTube channel. And guys, you can download my project file from my website. Thank you.